Welcome to wallsports.com. I'm Brian Duvall along with Highlanders head coach Mark Smith and coach the postseason is here and you get an opponent at home in Klein who was an old district rival and coming in in the regular season they were six and four. Three of their four losses by a total of nine points could have very easily been nine and one and champions of their district. Yeah, uh, they have uh, been in every football game and like you said uh, they lost two games by three points and they lost uh, their third district ball game in four overtimes uh, to a very good Atascacita football team, and so uh, they've uh, they're used to being in close games. They're used to they're used to playing in that type of situation, and uh, they're a good football team. Coach, your defense over over the district season only gave up one second half touchdown, uh, and that was into Oak Ridge very late in the game. You got to be really happy with the way the defense has played throughout the entire season. Yeah, very very pleased with. Uh, our, our defensive effort and uh, the way that the kids have stepped up and, and, and played, uh, you know, to, to be able to say that we've only given up one touchdown in the second half throughout your whole district uh, schedule is pretty impressive. And, uh, you know, we hope to continue that with, with those kids. Uh, they take a lot of pride in, in, in their efforts, and they know that they uh, have, have done uh, a lot to contribute to our success. Uh, and offensively, uh, you know, we have we have – we have done uh, done better in the second half as well uh, through district. You know, we scored more points in the second half than we have in the first half, and so uh, I think our kids are starting to uh, take a lot of pride in, in, in being a second half football team. Uh, however, you know, as a coach, you, you want you want us to be a a, uh, a four quarter football team, and so that's what we strive for uh, each and every day of practice. Coach, uh, postseason now you're eight and two, finished six and zero in the district. Now you're back to zero and zero. Uh, how do you get the guys to just make sure that they play and they're not too amped up? Uh, you know, w w this is the third season for us. You know, we, we, we break our season down into threes, uh, non-district, district, and postseason. And so, uh, you know, our big message this week is that what we've done in the past is in the past. Uh, everybody starts the playoffs at 0-0, and, and uh, only the winner gets to keep on playing. So the stakes are higher. There's a uh, greater sense of urgency. Uh, you know, and, and, and that's how we, how we uh, proceed. And you can't look down the road at anything. You've got to take it one game at a time. And uh, Klein is the biggest game of the year for us right now. Coach, uh, injury standpoint, how'd you come out of the Oak Ridge game and, and how's everybody coming out this week? Uh, we're very healthy. You know, uh, you, know, you know, when you play football for 10 weeks, you're going to have some bumps and bruises and some sprains, and, and we've got those. Uh, but as far as, uh, you know, injuries that would prevent kids from playing, uh, we're, in a, we're in great shape right now. Coach, uh, you've been through this postseason uh, all the way down to the finals. What do you think is the biggest key for a team to make a run in the postseason? Well, you, you know, just like we talked about, uh, you got to be healthy. You know, you got to have all of the all of your uh, pieces of the puzzle that, that you think give you a chance. And and right now we're 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 pretty healthy. Uh, you know, you you've got to uh, keep the kids focused, and you've got to. Uh, you know, kind of change gears and, and understand that the stakes are higher and uh, that uh, every team that you're going to you're going to face is a quality football team. Uh, some some better than others, but, uh, you know, there, there are no cakewalks anymore when you get to, to the postseason. And so we got to be at the top of our game each and every week, uh, you know, and from and from going to the to the state finals uh, back in 03, I know that there has to be some some luck that falls your way as well, uh, you know, and and. You know, luck doesn't just happen. Luck uh, comes from, you know, you preparing to be in, 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 the, in the right place at the right time when, when fortune comes your way. And so, uh, you know, th there has to be some of that. Uh, and, you know, you, you got to make plays when, when you have those opportunities to, to, to make those plays. All right, Coach, thanks for your time and, and good luck. And, folks, for the latest on the Highlanders, keep it right here to wallsports.com.